a clear golf ball. It's kind of cool. We're out creek fishing today, if you can't tell. It rained a lot last night. So, that's not good. I'm determined to find some fish out here. Kind of like the look of this. Easy to stand on. Let's, uh, let's keep moving. That is steep. Nope. It is not a fish. Darn. Got excited there for a minute. Right. Let's go down a little further. I can get back up this hill. This may be a challenge. Oh, slippery. Well, guys, I never really did a good intro for this video. As you can see, we are creek fishing. I'm out for looking for my first smallmouth of the year. That's the goal. We're out here in the DuPage River. This is a river I really don't fish. I never fish this river, actually. I've heard there's smallmouth here. I'm trying to find some. We're throwing this little cool baits under spin. <laughs> And that's a slip. Jeez. Nice going, Mike. Good intro so far. Am I hurt? My pride is a little hurt, I guess. I'm trying to find anything. I'm, I'm willing to take any smallmouth. I'll take a large mouth. I'll take a pike. But I'd like, I'd like to get that smallmouth out of the way. We might hit a couple creeks today. That is a branch. So yeah, I'm fishing a section of the DuPage River. That isn't too far from my house, but I've I've never fished here before. I really never fished the DuPage, so I don't know what to expect really. I know there's some people who have some good success. Uh, this looks very, 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 very muddy. How muddy is this? <laughs> eh, got a bunch more rain last night. I imagine this creek is, well, I think it was up here. It was probably another foot or so higher in the middle of the night. We're just going around casting. I don't really know anything about spots in this river. So far I'm snagging lots of junk, but no fish. Well, I'm about convinced that there's no fish in this stretch of the river. Alrighty, fellas. We gave up on the DuPage River for today. We're out at another river. One that I have a little bit more history with. Probably could wade this. Doesn't look too bad, actually. How cold is this? Is this real cold? It's actually not that bad. All right, well, I didn't plan to wade, actually. I really didn't, but it just looked pretty good out here. gonna walk up and down this little god there's so many little mats oh my gosh there's like thousands of these little mats get out of here man it's a little deeper over here I'm looking for those deeper pools There we go. Guys, I did it on this little cool baits underspin. I really like this underspin. Again, I got this in my mystery tackle box for the month of uh, for the month of April. I thought this was a, like a little, uh, a deeper little spot. And sure enough, this little guy came up and came up and grabbed it. So let's uh, let's let this guy go here. Whoa. I'm just gonna keep casting here for a little while. See if uh, he didn't have a friend. I guess the DuPage and me are not friends. 
but uh, I like this little river. You know, guys, of all the styles of fishing that I do, this is probably my favorite. Yeah, you know, really, this is this is such an enjoyable way to spend the day. It's always been fun on exploring all this stuff too. There's just there's so much stuff to look at. As I was walking back, I saw this down here. See that? Give you a sense of what they're feeding on. It's minnows and crayfish. I've uh, I've got another rig that is more for crayfish, but I need to find some slower water to throw that in. All right, let's uh, let's get back on land, and then we'll figure out where we want to go next. Overall, I'm just happy I got one fish. Well, I just found some golf balls of Wilson, some pro staff, some Titleist, some top flight. We're gonna get in here, which is a little sketchy. This is pretty deep, deeper than I would normally get in. And I can't see the bottom, unfortunately. I'm trying to go up the river a little bit because I know it's shallower. But so far the shallow water is evading me. No, no, no. I know it gets shallower out there somewhere. Yeah. Nope. Holy crap. Okay, well, scratch that. Holy cow. That was a lot deeper than I expected. Okay, well, last option here. I got one. Oh, I finally got one. Finally. Look at that, guys. Gorgeous fish. I'm excited. Took. Oh, he just splashed the heck out of me. And you. Took me long enough. I was literally about to leave. He soaked me. I'm, I'm literally, I'm soaking wet. Gosh, I knew that there had to be some fish in here. And this is a point where two, two little creeks meet. And, uh, it seems to always hold some fish. Got some little baby fry over here. I don't know if you could see those. There they are. So, I'm just, oh, I saw that. Guy just hit a golf ball right in front of me here. Closer this way. This way? Yeah. It's kind of towards that metal thing popping out of the water there. Oh. I got one, and it's a big one. And I got a fish. <laughs> it's a big fish. Oh, look at that. Guys, look at that fish. That's a gorgeous fish. Oh, man. This is probably a two pound fish. And look how fat that fish is. If you can see that, look how fat that is. Awesome. This made it all worthwhile, guys. That is a really nice fish really fat let's and there he goes oh nope look at this he's right here i can literally grab him <laughs> holy cow that was pretty awesome wow that felt good Okay, well these fish just take, I guess like 50 casts to catch today. I got another one. 
We got another one. Guys, this this little <laughs> this little uh cool baits little underspin with this little cool baits trailer is just smoking them today. Guys, get out there. This is a mystery this is the reason why you, you use mystery tackle box right here is because you get to try out new baits. I've never fished this before until two nights ago. I pulled it out of the box. I went fishing. I caught a largemouth basically with one of my first couple casts. And yesterday I went out and struggled. Struggled pond hopping. This was the only bait that caught a fish. And finally today, oh, that guy just hit it in the water. Today I'm finally catching some fish and we're using this little cool baits with this little trailer. I'll go over the bait in a second. Let's let this guy go. All right. So, again, this is the bait. I, and I'm probably not doing this perfectly because I'm using straight braid. A straight braid tied to this. But here it is. It's just a little, real little underspin. You can see it's already getting beat up. I've been banging this thing off of rocks. It's been caught a number of fish so far. And this really simple trailer. I mean, I don't even have it on here perfectly, but really simple trailer gives very little action. I think of it as like a finesse underspinner, a finesse spinner bait. Small little willow leaf blade, gives off a hint of a flash, not much, but enough. And, uh, and it seems to be doing the trick today. Uh oh, oh no, 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 okay. Whew. I gotta tell these guys that his ball went in the water. Oh, never mind. He's not even gonna look for it. We're gonna have to get going soon. Well, definitely worthwhile coming here. Very happy I made that choice. I think that's gonna probably wrap up the day, guys. We'll take a couple more casts, but thanks for following me along today. It's a bit of a struggle, but you know, overall, still a pretty pretty solid day four fish and uh you know maybe two hours of actually of actual fishing guys get out there go out to your uh, local creeks obviously right now it's not ideal um, because of all the rain we're getting and it, i don't think it's really going to stop but you know go test out some of your local creeks you'll be surprised at what you can find in them it's a lot of fun don't be afraid to get wet go get some water shoes and and get out there and, and find some uh Find some creek smallies. Trust me, you'll be addicted just like I am. So I think that's gonna end the day. Thanks for watching. This is Windy City Bastion. Sign in, out. Take it back, let's take a few casts upstream. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, come on. Oh, thank God I got it free. Well, I bent that hook out just, just a tad. Hmm. There. Good as new. Time to go.